Hi, I'm Dr. Bertice Berry, and I want to tell you a story. Uh, recently, a black person who doesn't speak in jive was talking jive to me, and I realized <laughs> that they thought they needed to talk to me that way because they were not as black as I am. <laughs> it was it was it was just the weirdest thing. It was one of the weirdest things that I've encountered. It was like, this is my home girl. It was like, you don't talk like that. And neither do I. It's like the word sassy. When people tell me I'm looking sassy, I'm like, do, do you use that word often? Probably not. Probably as often as you use spry to describe a young person who really is spry. <laughs> It's like saying honey child to your gay friend, but you don't ever say it to any other man. Sassy. My black women friends, when they say when they get the sassy card, they're like, what? <laughs> Stop using that. Stop telling us we're sassy. We. <laughs> I know you think that was sassy. It's not. And it's a little shady. And it's like you're throwing shade under the tree that I planted. Stop. But when this woman was, was talking jive talk, you know, like from the 70s to me, and she's black because she thought that's what I needed. I was confused, perplexed, <laughs> befuddled. I love you. And I do believe that when we get close enough, we know what people want to hear. They know, We know how they want to hear it. We know what, <laughs> we know what is kind of whack. I'm not going to walk up to you and ask you if you use a washcloth. I'm not going to do it. Anyway, I love you. Um, and yesterday I, I, my mind wrote a check that my body can't cash and I need to <laughs> go back and crash. I love you.